Welcome to Can Do Chinese by ChineseClass101.com. 大家好，我是李嫣如。Hi everyone, I'm Yin Ru Li. In this lesson, you learn how to order two or more of something while pointing. This is Karen Lee, and she's waiting in line at a coffee shop with her husband. The barista turns to Karen and says, "What would you like?" 您要什么 ？Listen to the conversation and focus on Karen's response. Ready? 您要什么？两份这个。Once more with the English translation. 您要什么 ？What would you like? 两份这个。Two of these. Want to know if your Chinese skills are improving and what your real learning level is? Get your language skills assessed with our free level assessment test. Just click the link in the description and sign up for a free lifetime account to get assessed. Let's take a closer look at the conversation. Do you remember how the waiter says, "What would you like?" First is, 您 the formal you, when addressing people of higher social status, such as seniors and customers. 您您 Next is, 要 to want, or to need, but translating as would like in this context. 要要 After that is, 什么 What? 什么什么 Together, 您要什么 Literally, you want what, but translates as, What would you like? 您要什么 Let's take a closer look at the response. Do you remember how Karen says, Two of these. First is, 两 two. This way of saying the number two is used before a measure word. 两两 Next is, 份 a measure word meaning serving or order. 份份 Together, 两份 Two orders. 两份 After that is, 这个 This. 这个这个 Pronunciation note: 这个 can be pronounced as 这个 or 这个这个 is more common in everyday speech. Altogether, 两份这个 two orders of these, but in more natural English, two of these. 两份这个 Note: This pattern is the shortened form of. 我要两份这个 I would like two of these. 我要两份这个我 I. 我，我。After that is, 要 would like in this context. 要 The speaker omits 我要 as it is understood from the conversation. 两份这个 The pattern is. Number, 份这个 Number of these. Number, 份这个 To use this pattern, simply replace the number placeholder with the number of items you're requesting. Imagine you'd like three of something you don't know the Chinese word for. Three, 三三
三 Say three of these. Ready? Sun Fun Joker. Three of these. Sun Fun Joker. When talking about a specific number of things in Chinese, not only do you need a number, but also a major word before the noun. For example, in our dialogue, we use the number liang, two, plus the major word fen, order, before the item. In Chinese, there are hundreds of major words for different types of things. A good major word to start with for beginners is ge, which is a general major word that goes with almost everything. For example, 一个面包 one piece of bread, 两个香蕉, two bananas, or 三个这个, three of these. Let's look at some more examples. Listen and repeat or speak along with the native speakers. 两份这个, 两份这个, 三份这个, 三份这个, 四份这个, 四份这个, 一份这个, 一份这个, 要两份这个和一份这个。要两份这个和一份这个. Did you notice how I used a different pattern? Did you take your free level assessment yet? Here's an extra bonus resource you'll get when you take the assessment. When you receive your result and learning level, you also unlock a free language course for your specific level, so you can start learning and level up your language skills. Just click the link in the description to get access. I would like two of these and one of these. First is Yao A shortened form of Wo Yao I'd like Yao The speaker omitted the subject Wo I and used only the verb yao would like. Yao liang fen jiga. I'd like two of these. Yao liang fen jiga. When pointing out multiple items, you can join them with the conjunction he, meaning and. He, he. Pronunciation note when yi one is followed by a fourth tone, it changes to the second tone. Yi such as Yi Fen Yi Fen Here is the variation pattern. Yao number Fen Jaga He number Fen Jaga I'd like number of these and number of these. You should be aware of this pattern, but you won't need it for this lesson. Let's review the key vocabulary. Si. Four. Si. Si. San. Three. San. San. 一 one 一 一 Let's review. Respond to the prompts by speaking aloud. Then repeat after me, focusing on pronunciation. Ready? 
Do you remember how to say the major word for order or serving? Fen. Fen. And how to say two orders of something? Liang fen. Liang fen. And do you remember how Karen Lee says, two of these? Liang fen jiga. Do you remember how to say what? Shama. Shama. And the polite way to say you. Nian. Nian. Do you remember how the waiter says? What would you like? Ning Yao Shema Nian Yao Shema. Do you remember how to say three? San San and how to say four. 四, 四. Do you remember how to say one? 一, 一. Let's practice. Imagine you're Ben Lee, and you're at the coffee shop with two friends. Order three of these. Ready? Ning Yao Shema San Fen Jago. Listen again and repeat. San Fen Jago. San Fen Jago. Let's try another. Imagine you're Sasha Lee, and you're at the coffee shop with three friends. Order for four people. Ready? Ning Yao Shema. Listen again and repeat. 四分这个 Let's try one more. Imagine you're Mark Lee, and you're by yourself. Order one of something by saying, one of these. Ready? 您要什么? Listen again and repeat. This is the end of this lesson. Now that you're finished with this lesson, want to know if your Chinese skills have improved? Take our free assessment test to assess your language. Discover your true learning level and get free access to a language course for your specific level. An easy to follow course where you learn the real language, the everyday conversations that you'll soon have and absorb these practical conversations just by listening along with quick audio and video lessons from real teachers. So click the link in the description and sign up for a free lifetime account to get assessed. Now you know how to order two or more of something in Chinese. That's all there is to it. Keep practicing and move on to the next lesson.